Hi, my name is Jill, and this is my channel, Broken People Awakening. I started this channel in 2018 with intentions of sharing my experience and the experiences I was having at the time, but I didn't follow through with it. Um, I had to get my life in order. I had just left my entire life, came out to the ocean, and I needed to work on getting an apartment, sending for my daughter, starting my new life. Uh, I decided to go to college after I got an apartment, got my daughter, and been pretty busy with that and going within. Um, learn, I've learned a lot and now is the time to start sharing it. I've had a lot of experiences and realizations um, that I think could be helpful for other people that are, might be, well, that might be struggling. Um, you know, you just start awakening and, and there's, a, it's like a big maze and there's a lot of dead end sometimes you know that's that's how we raise our consciousness is uh, having these obstacles and and problems and people that don't resonate with us anymore and all these different things just bombarding us and it's up to us to sift through it and um, let let the old stuff the bad negative stuff stuff that doesn't resonate any longer with us go um, that's how we bring in new things, new energy, new ways of being, new beliefs by letting the old stuff go. So I think I'm just going to uh, just talk a little bit and see what comes out. Okay, I think there's a, is there some way to switch the camera? It was there before. Oh, I think it doesn't there. It goes away when you press record, huh? Well, let me just flip it over and you guys can look at the ocean. Okay, cool. Um, let's see. I would say we should talk about awareness. Self-awareness other awareness see a lot of a lot of things we internalize a lot of situations uh, you need to be in the present moment as much as possible because your head is only gonna uh, be detrimental to you <laughs> I've learned that. If I've learned anything, I've learned that much. Uh, holding on to stuff, reliving it. You know, it, it's great to reflect upon positive things and things you've learned and, you know, outcomes that, that turned out positive. Maybe you might have to kind of go, the, go through the whole story if you're still caught up in that. Start from the beginning, you know, and play it out like a movie in your head. But all, all the negative stuff, you need to just let it go. And you find yourself thinking about things or reliving certain experiences and events that uh, were not for your highest good. Just, just, just get it out of your head. Just like, you know, have the awareness, the inner awareness to stop, be present. Breathe. You know, that's how you get back is you just realize that you're, you're like breathing through your mouth or, you know, doing something stupid and, and you just got to like realize it's time to slow down, get those thoughts out of your head and just breathe. Mm. 
can't help anybody else. If you're not uh, in tune with your own, your own mind, body, and spirit. See, we are, we are the masters. Okay. So many of us have let our body take control, and it, it's it's like compulsions or obsessions or just uh, you know like a, the silliest little thoughts. Still, things come into my awareness or into my mind, and everything is not. Every thought is not what you're meant to do. There's a there's a, a, a line. There's a big line between intuition and impulsive behavior. I don't know if this is making any sense so far, so I'm trying to find some kind of analogy or something. Uh, let's see. Okay, so you're you're sitting there. You all of a sudden think that you want a red bathing suit. So instantly you go shopping for one. Okay, that's impulsive behavior. You are supposed to be on your in intermittent fast. But you remember something you've got in the freezer, some really good ice cream or something like that, and you just give into it. You're just like, oh, okay, I'll start tomorrow. Okay. Those are the things that you want to uh, try to have some type of self-control and the awareness that it's just your mind, you know, and it's just your body that want it. Um, like, sometimes I'll think of something that's in the other room and, and I'm, I'm doing something. I'm, like, busy. I'm, you know, trying to be uh, engaged in something else. And, and that engagement just falls short. And I'm, your body, your body just gets up and walks in the other room to go get something stupid. And that's, that's, uh. Those are behaviors that we gotta just kind of try to curtail that stuff. Try to have some control. Um, because in those behaviors, the body is the master. The mind and the body are the master. And our spirit is just like, you know, just, just watching it go down. You know? Because our, our spirit's not gonna start screaming at us, you know? It's just like, okay. All right, that's what you're doing. <laughs> anyway, okay, that's just a little bit on self-awareness and the inner awareness. Be aware of the behaviors that you're projecting forward. Uh, another form of awareness is outer or other awareness. Other awareness is basically having a genuine empathy for others. Not judging, not criticizing, not thinking you're better than, uh, not hating. Um, everybody's going through what they're going through. You know, I mean, there, there are situations that have come up in the world lately that really should be making everybody stand back and, and take a look at how they treat others. You know, you guys know right from wrong, right? You wouldn't be here. But, you know, some, sometimes people are struggling and we place blame on them, you know, that they, they could, they'll never get it together or, or uh, you know, just just talking smack to you. That's not helping them, okay? That's not helping them at all. All it's doing is making you feel superior. Maybe come at that kind of stuff from a different angle. You know, maybe try to show that person some, some friendship, some love, you know, like. Maybe just, uh, have a conversation with them. Find out where they're coming from. You know, you're not walking in their shoes. Listen and just uh, don't judge. 
deal for people. Anyway, I don't want to get uh, too deep on this first video, so I think that's all I've got for now. Thank you. God bless you. The universe loves you. We'll talk soon. Much love.